Welcome to Tamina's World. This is the third time I've tried to do this video because Jayla keeps on interrupting and coming through the door. So I just wanted to do a 16 week update because I have not done an update in a few weeks and it's been a long time. So as you can see I'm getting better, I'm getting over my sickness, um, I've been feeling yeah pretty good I'm still kind of sick a little run down a little but I'm feeling pretty good um what else Ch -ch -ch. okay cravings I've been craving so badly a quarter pounder from McDonald's with extra sauce and mustard and oh my god they're chips I haven't had it like in two weeks but I'm like I think about it all the time um, so I'm really like craving a lot of saucy stuff at home I'll have like a ham and cheese toasty with tomato paste on it um, to satisfy that craving for lunch or something um, I'm able to drink cup of teas now where before I couldn't really hold down dairy um, what else I've been having a lot of round ligament pain a lot of pain in my back in my belly um, I can feel the baby my little man moving at times it kind of just feels like a wriggly worm um, where the other night at the dinner table I just kept on constantly feeling him where for the last couple of days I've only felt little bits and pieces but I'm starting to feel him more and more um, like if I'm sitting down I notice it but obviously if I'm doing stuff I don't really notice it um, but at the moment it's just little flutters and um, every now and then I feel a little kick um, but yeah, like it's, it, it makes me happy to know that he's doing fine and everything like that. But um, so yeah, so cravings, I've been having round ligament pain. I've been pretty tired only because I've, I haven't been sleeping very well because I haven't been able to get comfortable and I've had a stuffy nose so I can't breathe. Um, what else? My belly's grown a little bit more... It's kind of slowed down. Once I popped, it kind of slowed down a little bit. I feel like he's sitting back in my back more. Um, my boobs have grown a lot and they feel so heavy. Um, they're not so much tender anymore, but my... I know this is too, too much information, but my nipples are really tender and sore, but not my actual breasts. So yeah, um, <laughs> so like I said in my other vlog, my anxiety has been up and down. This morning I woke up and felt like I couldn't breathe, but that was just me freaking out. I never had a good night's sleep last night as I was up with Jayla. She's, all the kids are sick with a cough, the flu that I had. So we've just been, they're home today actually. So we've just been looking after them. Um, yeah, so nothing really much has changed, although that I'm feeling much better. Even though I was sick with the flu, I'm feeling much better. I'm not so sick, like vomit sick or dry reaching sick. Um, I'm able to get around and do stuff now, where before I was literally bedridden for months. So yeah, but I'll quickly show you my belly. Um, I've got like, there's my belly. I've got actually these, you know the pants that hold, um, the belt that holds your pants up when your pants don't fit you anymore? Well, I'm wearing them. So that's the front, the other side. So I'm very high and wide, um, which is really crazy. But yeah, so that was my bump. Um, hasn't really grown much. I've just kind of popped and kind of stayed the same. But I've noticed this pregnancy compared to my last pregnancy with Jayla. Jayla, I suppose girl and boy pregnancies are different. But with Jayla, I put on 9 kilos the whole pregnancy, which is like a good amount of weight, but it's not like over the amount. Like they say, if put on 15 kilos um, is the minimum. Um, but I've, so far, I've put on like 2.5 kilos. But I'm really feeling, I haven't exercised in months, um, 
I've noticed that I'm getting really top heavy and my bum and my legs are getting chunky where I've never really had chunky bummer legs I've always been a top heavy kind of girl never put weight on any any time at all in my bum and legs but until now <laughs> oh and one other thing which is a major symptom is I've been super cranky my patience has been like zero I can't I just can't put up with um, things that I used to put up with so I'm very cranky um, but you know I'll get over it it's part of hormones so yeah anyway guys I hope you have a great day I'll see you in our next vlog and yeah see you guys